At the town council meeting held on May 9, 2024, town manager Paul McCallie presented the proposed 2024-2025 default budget cuts to the council. One of the budget reductions made concerned the fire department's education and training line items. Fire Chief Mark DeFranzo explains the reasoning for making these budget cuts. All of these cuts are going to hurt, but the public has spoken and we have to come up with something. So losing overtime for live fire training, that's a huge hit for us. Can't make that up. Training is just as important as response, but I need the response. So we're willing to figure out a better way to do training. It's not decimating my training budget, but it's certainly not going to be where I'd like it to be. Town Councilor Andy Hunter requesting that if additional savings are found in the budget throughout the year, that it be put towards the fire department's training. You know, I understand there may be additional savings in the budget throughout the year, and I would just ask that you monitor that and try to prioritize training. Town Manager Paul McCallie following up to express the difficulty in making this budget cut, but that training could be done differently. I don't want to say we, we, we just cut willy-nilly training. It was, it's a hard decision to, to make some of these cuts. You know, and, and you want a trained workforce. You want people educated. You want people with knowledge. But can we do it a different way? Yes, we can. Paul McCallie continued presenting the total savings made in order to reach the default budget goal, later adding that they did their best to not cut services in town. Council budget was $39,778,566. Subtract the $1.2 million or $1.3 million away from it. You're right on your default number of $38,484,241. We tried not to cut services. We really did. We tried not to cut services. There might be some changes in the way we have to do things internally, but we're looking out looking at the residents that hopefully they won't see much of a difference. Councillor Tom Koenig expressing his gratitude for the hard work and explaining that the default budget would have a big impact down the road. It'll be easy for some people to say, look, you cut $1.3 million out of the budget, no big deal. But it, it isn't that. It is a big deal in training and maintenance and replacement of older equipment and things like that, it's all going to impact us. I think this is going to at least respond to what the, the voters said they wanted and uh, we'll move on from here, but I appreciate all the work everybody did to try and come up with the, these kinds of numbers. The town council voting unanimously in favor of the proposed default budget cuts. Call the question, all those in favor of the motion signify by saying aye. 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 Opposed? or abstained. 700. To watch the meeting in full, download the Merrimack TV app. This has been Merrimack in Motion. Thank you for watching.